In this lesson, I want to explain the win tool in Mars Designer. <clears throat> For begin, I create some pattern here that we want to blow a win on it. And for seeing the wind controller, you're going to have to go in here and show the wind controller. And as you can see, this is our wind controller. You can select it and change it. And as you can see, the wind controller has a direction. This blue arrow <clears throat> shows you the wind direction. When you select the wind, we have an important properties here. Here, first, we can activate the wind. Uh, turn on the simulation. And as you can see, it falls down. Don't forget to pin it. Going here and pin box and click and drag to pin it. I explained it before and as you can see, it does not fall and simulation is on. <clears throat> Select the wind and when you active the wind, this is our wind. And this is the first type of the wind is in a type is a planner. It means it's blowing from one direction. The placement of the wind is not important because it's infinite from this direction to the that direction. If you rotate it, if you, for example, rotate, as you can see, the wind direction will be changed. <clears throat> so in a planner, just the direction of the wind is important. For example, you can change the direction in this, in this, nice, okay? So this is a planner uh, wind. Go in here and select Control C and Control, sorry. Can control C and what does it mean? Oh, I'm gonna select the pin. I don't want to select it. Yeah, <clears throat> select it and bring another pattern here. And as you can see, because of the planner wind uh, direction is going here to the here but if you change it to the spherical and as you can see the direction of the uh, wind is changing it's blowing from the center to the surface in all direction 360 in all direction and in this case the position of the wind um, point and wind source is important so this is type spherical here you can change the strings. Here you can activate the K activation. That is all about the uh, animation uh, editor here. It's all about the animation editor that I will be explaining it in an animation editor part. You can activate animation. You can change animation strings. You can change the position. Animate. You can animate your parameter here. <clears throat> it's a DK. It's a something like damping. You can change the damping. The frequency is turning on or off. For example, set it to two, it's turn it on for uh, two seconds and it's then the frequency. It's actually mm, negative the number, positive and negative the number of the strings. As you can see, the blowing in this direction, then blowing that direction, it's the frequency. But the most important thing here is the turbulence. It's changing the power, changing the frequency, changing damping and uh, randomize the wind blowing and it's become more than realistic wind so you can change the number that you want and you can active them uh, tolerance and uh, remember them rotation cape activation are all for uh, animation you can animate them that i will explain in next lesson don't worry in this new version you can animate everything in uh, actually wind you can animate wind you can animate you have more control to animating uh, some things in Morris designer so this is a wind that's very simple and easy hello my friends to continue these tutorials on YouTube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.